What you gonna do when they come for you? Boom, 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 boom. Work ain't not as what it pays the bill. <laughs> yes, God, Mr. Girl. Did you get to this last episode of the Housewives, honey? My hair is laid like we'll work for camera time. No, God, honey. Let me tell you something. Ever since Marlo had this step to her ass on the scene, Five, six years ago, she been doing any damn thing possible to get her a piece of camera time on these RHOA cameras. She went from being Nene Bestie, then when Nene went film with her, she went to being Kenya Bestie, then when Kenya went film with her ass. Now she done hopped over there with Sheree, the person she damn near beat up in Africa just to get a little piece of camera time. And Carlos gonna use her ass till he use her up. <laughs> yeah. Work ain't honest, but it pays the bills. We see you, Marlo, and it's so funny because rarely do I ever give Kenya any kind of benefit of the doubt. But the gag is, Kenya ass was nervous as fuck when Marlo walked her bully ass in there because Marlo about that life. She really is. Kenya got nervous as hell. And Kenya said, before this shit escalated in front of all these people at this pop-up shop and this bitch embarrassed me with all this white on, I'm going to pull her to the side and I'm going to apologize right quick. But see, Marlo wasn't here for the bullshit. Yes, God, honey. Now, I think in real life, Marlo would have been there for but Marlo knew, okay, bitch, they midway through the season and they didn't call me to film at all. So, I got to be as drama-filled as possible to make the scene good so Carlos will call me to film again. Girl, Marlo, <laughs> Marlo you was assisting the bitch who didn't need no help. Sheree needed negative help. She only had seven t-shirts up there. And the real read is when that Chiron came across the bottom of the screen and they had Candy donated a thousand, this person donated a thousand, this person donated a thousand. Sheree they said $450. Lord, I'm, work ain't honest, but it pays the bills. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Get it, girl. But I'm going to tell you one thing about Marlo. She looked it good, honey. She looked it good. But see... In Atlanta right now, the people is going around really laughing at Marlo. All the reality scene, all the Instagram thought girls going. Because of all them girls, Marlo been the only person who ain't been able to get a paid television job. Like, she getting booked in gay clubs and book fairs. You know what I'm saying? But, girl, catch. I heard it's the TV show in development. And Marlo just might be getting her big break on the reality TV scene. Lord, please, let's help. Dragon Hampton, get her a role on reality TV because we tired of her begging for scraps on Real Housewives of Atlanta selling t-shirts that don't nobody want just to get two inches of field time. And then she picked the right one to roll with Sheree without running back them bones, gossiping and whatnot. It was cute or whatever, but you know what? Somebody had put on one of my blog posts. At this point, many of those women are incapable of creating genuine organic friendships and child I believe it they all are social climbers and Marlo look like she ready to hang with any bitch that'll help her get on that camera but let me get off of Marlo it's enough old white men getting on her on top of it that is let me move on to something else this episode of R.H.O.A. honestly and truthfully besides some dragging Hampton dragging her ass on the damn screen really wasn't a whole whole lot going on Cynthia in this house we all know Matt and, and Cynthia was not about to move into Candy damn house. Uh, Cynthia, uh, Kenya, and Matt, okay, you know, somewhere along the lines, make believe and real life have gotten blurred somehow, and there's some crazy shit going on with them and Kenya. Yeah, at the point at which, you know, I do think Kenya is crazy and she do bring a lot on herself and do a lot, but I don't think she bust out her own glass in her garage car or damaged her house or spray painted her camera. So at that point. This motherfucker's crazy, Kenya Moore. You need to leave him alone. Uh, Maya Angelou, Iyanla, Oprah, Wes, uh, Wes Brown, and everybody said when somebody show you who they are, believe them. Kenya, even dead Miss Cleo can see you trying to turn the prince into a papa. Okay, I mean a papa into a prince. I don't know, fuck up a Miss Cleo reference. Nonetheless, bitch, it don't take no clairvoyant, no psychic, or no supernatural ability to see that you need to leave this damn boy alone. See, the, oh, you, should, you need to go back and get old cornbread head Walter. All Walter was going to do was tow your car. Okay, with the illegal government contracts he got, got the whole DeKalb County sold up with them tow trucks. But that's a whole other expose for a slow news day. 
I'm trying to think. Oh, girl, do Apollo parents look like trailer trash or is they look like trailer trash? No, God, honey. That lady look like the only thing she got in her ashtray is two quarters and a pack of Newports. Look, ooh, I mean, I listen. The country already divided as hell with Trump being the president, so I ain't finna even get on white people. But I promise you, Apollo mama look like she lived next door to Honey Boo Boo. And that's just all to it. Work ain't honest, but it pays the bills. I'm trying to think what else was going on. Cynthia moving, Candy selling them toys. Cynthia got a wide pussy, but she really don't. It ain't like, her pussy not wide like this. It's, it's not wide like this. It's wide like this. Okay? Not like this, but like this. Woo! Woo! Shout out to the AKAs. Uh, happy Father's Day to y'all. The Delta was not too far behind y'all. The Capital was behind y'all. The Alphas was behind y'all. Shout out to all the APAC and the Greeks, National Panhellenic Council. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to think what else is going on. Portia and that boy, King. Yeah, it was just fun. And I ain't even to sit here and go in on Marlo for another 15 minutes because that's too easy. She's such an easy read. Anyway, Nessa Girl, that's all I got. Ain't got no more. Cause I fly above all the haters. Uh, I fly above. Uh, I fly above. Uh, uh. <laughs> Let me get out of here and get me a glass of wine. And remember, work ain't honest, but it always pays the bills. Bye!